Hey, what's up, everybody? And welcome back to Jay Stringer for Views and More. Today, we're going to do a little unboxing and a first look at Soundcore's newest release, the Boom 2. Now, they kind of tweaked this a little bit. Supposedly, from what I've read, it's supposed to be three times louder than the Motion Boom, which would be shocking. That's a quite a claim. Anyway, we're going to do an unboxing here real quick. As with most Soundcore speakers, they come, they'll have wrapped in plastic. This is a little overkill to cut some plastic off, but that's what we're doing. A lot of times they don't seal their speakers like with a little plastic or a little sticky seal. They just wrap it in plastic. Let's get Sir mix lot out of the way before he gets knocked over. Oh, that does have a seal on it. Excuse me. So they got it wrapped in plastic. And it has a seal. Imagine that. If I can get the seal off. If I had a smaller knife, it might work better. <laughs> All right, there we go. We'll pull out. Got your manual, instructions, all that good stuff there. As a USB C to C cable. So not A to C. It looks like that's it. Yep. So I'm guessing this probably doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter jack. They've been kind of getting rid of those, unfortunately. Now, I opted for the green color. I thought, you know, black is something I always get in. They offer blue and green. So I went with green. Kind of has some, like, lime green feet. <clears throat> so the texture of it is, eh, it's okay plastic. It's not the cheapest feeling. It does have some little grooves underneath the handle for your fingers. That's nice. It's not very heavy. Now, if you know, most of the Soundcore speakers are not very heavy. The Boom Plus is not heavy. So, your button layout, it has a little sticker on there that goes over the layouts. Now, this has one woofer in the middle, kind of a racetrack shape, and then it has two tweeters, which is the same design as the, I think the, the 500. The X500 has the same design, so we'll probably put it up against that because I think it's 129 normally, somewhere around there. That's what this is running. So, I'm powered up. We do have some lights on the passive radiators now. Kind of cool. No lights on the front. In the back, sure enough, you've got... A USB-A, which I don't know if this will play off of that or not, or just charge other devices, and a USB-C, Soundcore branding. So let's back the camera up, and I'll pair this up to my tablet, see what we have. All right, so I'm about six feet back from the speaker, zoomed in a little bit. Now, when I powered this on, it prompted me immediately, since I already had the Soundcore app, to connect to that. So connecting to the app was pretty easy. I'll go over more of that when I do a review, but there are some options for light modes and such. So we're just gonna do this today, right now, in its default EQ, which is Soundcore Signature. So like I said, we'll do a full video on this. And we'll go more in depth into custom EQ and the different EQs that are available on the speaker. So we'll start this. Uh, let's see, start this at 40%, and here we go. Bass up is on. Has a nice full sound to it. See what happens when we turn the bass up off. It 
does thin out a little bit. Not as bad as some speakers do, though. Back on. Let's go down to 27%. Sounds a little thinner at 27. Go up to 60%. Change track. Let's get some rock going, baby. Come on, let's run it. For mix a lot, it's like, what? Come on, baby. Woo! Go to 80%. Check the mic make sure it sounds right, boy. Go, baby. First look at the new Soundcore speaker, Boom 2. Sounds good, gets pretty loud. I don't know about it being three times louder than the Motion Boom. I don't know where they come up with that. But overall, yeah, this is a good speaker. I'll do a more in-depth video on it and give you guys a little more look at the app and what it does. So look for that coming soon. But yeah, I this, this was available for a while pre-order kind of deal wasn't a pre-order but you got a code that you got some of their free earbuds to come along with it i think it's 129.99 so the problem with that is it kind of prices itself in a weird spot soundcore has too many speakers really but this definitely is a good sounding speaker it gets pretty loud let me know what you guys think in the comments below like and subscribe if you haven't done so today sir mix lots giving you a one-time offer it's free costs you nothing and he will tell you this channel is always worth every bit of nothing. Because baby got back. Catch you guys in the next one.